with Brittany and this is so exciting that we're finally doing a collab and you guys can you know go subscribe to her channel watch her video it'll be linked down below and of course at the end of the video and everything in this video we're gonna be sharing with you some DIY treats and snacks that you can bring along to your picnic essentials and outfit and Brittany also did like a makeup look on her channel so you can go check out her video and everything and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like collabs and everything because we like them. Oh yeah. They're really fun. <laughs> they so, are fun. Yeah. And I also wanted to quickly mention that I am featured on Erica's Beauty and the Vlog channel. She did a like podcast interview and it's so cool that I was interviewed. So I'll have the links down below to that and where you can buy it on iTunes. And that was just really neat of her to do that. So I'm really excited about that. But other than that, let's get on with the picnic video. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know which way it's gonna go. <laughs> so starting off with some essentials, you're gonna need a picnic basket of some sort. I also brought along some plates and napkins, and Brittany brought along her donut speaker, which is so cute. I also grabbed some sunglasses, and then I also grabbed some activities to do, so I brought my Polaroid camera to take pictures with, and we brought some bubbles to play with because they're super fun. Don't even lie, you love bubbles too. And then we also brought a blanket. The first DIY treat that I made for the picnic was a drink and this basically I found on Pinterest and I wanted to color my lemons and so all you have to do is take a regular lemon and cut it into slices and then pour water into three different containers or as many containers as you want and then take food coloring and put that into the water and you can like add as much as or as little as you want to make them as opaque or as not as you like and I basically just tried to make some pretty colors that would stand out and then I just put the lemons in online I read that it would take 15 minutes and nothing happens after 15 minutes so I left them in overnight and then uh, to make the mason jar a little bit more fancy I took some chalkboard labels and wrote our names on them and stuck them onto the mason jar so we could bring them and it's just something that like, you know can spice up the jar and then I also had some colorful straws that I added once we got to the picnic but basically in the morning you just have to pour some clear liquid into your glass you can totally use like water but I use 7up because I wanted I don't know I thought a pop would be kind of fun to do and then you just take your colored lemons and put them in and I was actually you know it was okay they turned out colored you can clearly tell that they have coloring on them but another thing that I really liked about this is it actually turned the drink part mint green so it came out as a pretty color in general so it wasn't totally a fail but I don't know it's what it is. The next treat turned out way, way better, and this is a s'mores trail mix type thing, and it's super, super easy, and it tasted amazing, so I highly recommend you guys try this out because it is so easy. All you need is three ingredients. That's golden grams, marshmallows, and melted chocolate, and I just got mine all in bulk at the store. So you basically take any container you want, layer with golden grams, stir some melted chocolate on there, pour it on and then add marshmallows on top. And I did a couple layers to fill the container, but once you pile it up and put the lid on, it looks so cute. And these containers are from Michaels and they were fairly inexpensive and they just look so cute with these things in them. And since it was really hot our day of the picnic, the chocolate actually started to melt when we were outside, which I didn't hate because it was delicious. <laughs> As you can see me here, I loved it. <laughs> And don't forget to go watch Brittany's video at the end to get the recipe on this awesome, awesome watermelon salad. It was seriously so good. But now moving into some activities that you can do with your friends at the picnic. We brought a Polaroid camera so we took some Polaroid pictures while we were playing with the bubbles because I love Polaroid pictures and they're so fun to have for summer memories and everything. And then we also just played with bubbles and they make really great Instagram pictures. I highly suggest you trying it. And these cost like a dollar at the dollar store. It's so inexpensive to just play with bubbles. We also brought some badminton rackets to play badminton. Not gonna say we were very good at it, but it is super fun to do with your friends and if you get a lot of people doing it, you can also bring like a beach volleyball or even a Noah football if you're into that kind of thing. <laughs> and moving on to my picnic outfit of the day. I just wore this really fun, bright, tropical two-piece that is from Toby.com, which is probably my favorite online clothing store, not gonna lie. I wore this with my white Converse and my sunglasses are from Old Navy. That is the end of the video. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Don't forget to click on Brittany's face to go watch her video and subscribe to her channel because you gotta do that. That'd be awesome. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I'll have them linked down below. And I'll see you in my next video. Have a great day. Bye! Bye.